today let's quickly break down the difference between an exclusive and a non-exclusive buyer agreement when you're looking to buy a home in New Jersey. With an exclusive buyer agreement, you're agreeing to work with just one agent. That agent will be with you every step of the way from finding the perfect property to negotiating offers and handling paperwork. In return, you agree not to work with any other agents while the agreement is in place. Now with a non-exclusive buyer agreement, you have more flexibility. You can work with several different agents or even find the property on your own. Both agreements have a termination clause, which allows both the buyer or the agent to end the agreement if things aren't working out. If for any reason you feel like the partnership isn't a good fit or you change your mind about moving forward, you can end the contract early, no hard feelings. There are a few things you need to be aware of before signing either agreement. Say for instance, you've seen a property with another agent. I can't represent you on that property. Once you've seen it with them, they'll be the one who needs to represent you until the agreement expires and the protection period is satisfied. The key is to check the agreement for any specific notes, requirements, or fees. But overall, it's designed to give you peace of mind and flexibility during the process. Both agreements have their pros and cons, so it's all about what works best for you. If you'd like to learn more about the home buying process, feel free to reach out to me anytime.